Korriban's flame to unidentified vessel. You have violated Imperial space. Submit your security clearance or be destroyed. You said I could leave this to you. Go ahead. Transmitting clearance code now. Stand by while I... Um... We're so pleased you're here, Grand Moth. You'll find our security airtight. That is unlikely. I've uh, cleared a docking bay for you. Please proceed with your landing, sir. For the moment, they believe I am Grand Moth Fresh. But this ruse will not hold. Prepare to kill everyone. Killing everyone might make finding out what's happening here a little difficult. Cripple those you think possess information. Kill the rest. Don't waste any time. Destroy the enemy while we have the elements of surprise. Right on time. You're practically a droid. I knew if I applied the right stimulus, you couldn't resist coming here. Something's wrong with Leha. She's not herself. She tricked me. Jomar was chasing proof you'd fall into the dark side. He fell into my trap like a greedy child. You were just as easy. The Emperor is dominating your mind. Resist him. Please, don't hurt her! She doesn't know what she's doing! Poor boy. You think you love me, but what we shared in secret on Tython was only a shadow of true passion. They indulged their base desires. Impressive. I'll show you true ecstasy, Jomar. But first things first. I don't want to hurt you. If you care about Jomar, surrender. Surrender is for the weak. Jomar had that option. You don't. You remember the Medes? I gave my little droid friends a few upgrades I think you'll enjoy. Briefly. It's me. You're going to be all right. My poor droids. How did we get here? It's been a long time since the Emperor defeated us. Concentrate. Try to remember. I... No. I don't want to. I can feel the Emperor's presence. I... He hates you. The things he made me do... Come home to Tython. Master Satil will help you. I have no right to ask you for anything, but... The Council doesn't need to know about us. Please, keep our relationship to yourself. There's a war on. I don't care about your indiscretion. Thank you. I... I'm sorry for all of this. I was wrong about you. 
My mission wasn't a total failure. I overheard Liha delivering orders from the Emperor to a high-ranking Sith Lord. I couldn't hear details, but I know someone named Lord Fulminus went on a secret mission to the planet Vos. Lord Fulminus? The Emperor isn't taking any chances with Vos. I'll take Liha home. Thank you for saving her. Us. Master Satil, I rescued Jomar and found Liha Narez. She's been under the Emperor's control and needs your help. They're headed for Tython now. I also learned a high-ranking Sith named Fulminus is on the planet Voss. That is disturbing news. Voss was discovered only recently. Its society is dangerously unbalanced. The people worship an elite group of Force users who rule with absolute authority. Despite our best efforts, Voss's government rejects the Jedi Code. The Emperor has always taken a great interest in that world. I thought he sought to conquer it, but clearly he intends its destruction. Go to Vos. Find Lord Fulminus and stop his plans. This is Joe Marchul. I wanted to thank you again for saving Liha, and I appreciate you keeping our relationship to yourself. I'm helping her recover from what happened. It's slow going, but she's making progress. I'm sorry I ever doubted you. I consider you a true friend. Jump aren't you allowed? in orbit around Voss, Master Satil. Be wary when you reach the surface. Voss is a strange world under the absolute control of a group of powerful Force users called the Mystics. The Mystics reject the idea that the Force has both a light and dark side. They claim to follow a neutral path, both in their politics and the Force. Despite their claims, I fear the Mystics have more in common with the Sith than with us. Are you saying the Voss are servants of the dark side? The Mystics use the visions given to them by the Force to control the lives of ordinary citizens. Like the Sith, they use their power to dominate others. The Mystics are prophets who shape the direction of Voss society. The Emperor wants to wipe out all life in the galaxy. Hardly the same thing. The Dark Side is subtle and insidious, as you well know. The Emperor did not begin his conquest of the galaxy by declaring his true intentions. Whatever the Emperor is up to, I'll stop it. We haven't uncovered the Emperor's plan to destroy Voss yet, but he recently dispatched a Sith Lord named Fulminus to this system. Lord Fulminus created the harrowers you face in the Emperor's fortress. Be wary. Give me his location, and I'll take care of this. We know Fulminus is somewhere on Voss. He's communicating with the Emperor through an encrypted communications relay. We've detected several signal scramblers outside the planet's capital city of Voss Ka. Disable them, and we can track the comm signal to his location. Fulminus wouldn't just leave those scramblers undefended. The signal scramblers were hidden deep inside the Savage Voss wilderness. Reaching them will be dangerous, even for a Jedi. If you act quickly, you should be able to disable all the scramblers before Fulminus knows what's happening. Then we can find him. May the Force be with you.
Hold up a minute. Commander Harada, station security. Glad I caught you before the shuttle. I have an urgent message from Ambassador Janik, our envoy on Voss. I'll patch him through now. Master Jedi, I'm well aware of the Order's stance on Voss, but the situation is getting desperate. Negotiations with the Voss have stalled, and I'm looking for high-profile help. Are you familiar with the planet? I'm interested in an ambassador's take. Ambassador, soldier, Jedi, civilian. We're all outsiders to the Voss. They have little knowledge of the greater galaxy and only recently obtained spaceflight from us, but they're not primitive. Their society revolves around the mystics, force users who have visions of the future. Those visions guide every decision the Voss make, and the Voss believe they're never wrong. Is that all the mystics can do? See the future? Mystics can also become gifted healers. A Republic alliance with the Voss could be key to winning this war. Unfortunately, the Empire has the same idea. So far, the Voss have refused to take sides, and they've established rigid neutrality laws to keep us in line. If Republic lives are at stake, don't expect me to stand aside. We let the Empire provoke us, and we lose our chances with the Voss. We need to show the Voss that the Empire only acts respectful because of the mystics. I'm doing everything I can to expose them, but the Voss don't seem to hear me anymore. A fresh face might help. I'm willing to represent the Order. The Jedi are the closest we have to a mystic. I can't hurt. I'm staying at a Voss survey outpost, keeping an eye on the Empire. Commander Harada can handle the details of getting here. Not much to arrange. Shuttle will take you to Voska, their capital city. Local transport can get you to the survey outpost. Remember, the Voss keep all outsiders confined to the alien enclave, regardless of affiliation. Someone makes trouble, ignore them. favors from the Voss here, a pointless pursuit. These people are aggressively self-interested. Kabanotase makipuna, malituta odmishka. Se kota do buti kihasa da punyo, liz di woto. I think I get what you're saying. Piti do tenya go kaka jojo, da biska ku paliya. Chonki faguta, chiho poda ji oto vokise. Sounds like the right thing to do. Kuchusa yo mata chitoya, nam kanoya choski nawi. Umpa hupa, chikilia umpasa do biska. Chikospa ini gudad ijigliska chanagawa. Welcome, please select an available travel route. Have a safe and pleasant stay.
These accusations are ridiculous. The Republic has only tried to protect the galaxy from the Empire. The Empire offers more power and protection than the Republic ever could, minus the rigid codes of morality. The Empire forgets the Vast protect themselves. Let us pause here. I believe the Ambassador has some introductions to make. Lord Beldis, speaking on behalf of the Empire. Larian Kai, Envoy to the Three. Your culture is new to me. Who are the Three? The Three govern. The mystics see. The Three decide. The Three state outsiders are only curiosity. I'd like to show the Voss something different. An example of everything the Republic stands for. Don't forget, Laren Kai. The Jedi Order views your mystics as tainted. The Order doesn't speak for me. The mystics are truth. Opinion does not matter. Off-world conflicts mean nothing. The Voss look forward. Outsiders look back. I will say no more. An excellent example, Ambassador. Weak and hopeless. Like you. The more Lord Beldis talks, the worse the Republic looks. We have to show the Voss what Sith like him are really after. Diplomacy isn't usually the Sith style. The Empire already tried to conquer Voss. The Voss annihilated them like they'd been prepared for years. Diplomacy's their only option. We know Lord Beldis has spies in Voss Ka. Our scouts think he's using some defunct Voss comm towers to communicate with them. The comm logs could prove Lord Beldis has designs against the Voss. I need someone to make it past the Empire's defenses. Isn't a firefight worse than spying on someone? If it doesn't disturb the peace or threaten the Voss, they don't concern themselves with it. Get those comm logs quick as you can. I'll be waiting.
spin this all you like, Ambassador. You tampered with Voss communication towers. Is that a fact, Lord Baldus? I suppose I forged the Imperial comm logs that came out of them, too. Stop. Neither were present. Both are blind. Those involved will answer. Did you strike against Voss? My goal was to protect the Voss from the Empire. Your protection is destructive. The towers were abandoned. No Voss were harmed. This will not happen again. I can personally guarantee that, Laren Kai. You against the Empire, and me against Lord Beldis. I'm not sure which fight was harder. Where do we go from here? The comm logs don't implicate Lord Beldis directly, but they prove he has Imperial spies in Voska. One of them is Malcolm Terax. Terax is one of Imperial Intelligence's best agents, but now he'll be executed. We can't let that happen. How can we be certain this is true? Standard Imperial procedure, now that his operation has been exposed. If we save Terax, he might talk. The SIS spotted a new Dusk Squadron camp nearby. They're Imperial assassins, and their location is perfect for a quiet execution. I'm willing to bet they're here for Terax. I'll protect him as if he were one of ours. Let's just hope he appreciates it. I'll make the arrangements for a deal with Terax. I just hope he's still alive. Bata chawa wermo mukima wahota muguto neombi bedwana ni bobo chopo uma she se kava kaya topa pupanda bakawanki i get the feeling there's something you're not telling me chingwanga la hagwa chikuska ampasa dobiska Was there some type of warning or message?
Terax, the Republic's offering you a pardon in exchange for information. Cavalry's come, has it? But maybe I don't like your terms. The things I know are worth more than my life. What makes you think I'll share any of them with you? Being executed for doing my job might make me a little angry. We're trained to think of it as our final duty. I help you. I forfeit my nice, quick shot to the head. The Empire will hunt me down and make me pay. So for the Republic to give me a fighting chance, I'll need credits, supplies, and transport off-world. You're in no position to make demands. And you're in no position to turn them down. Safe in the arms of the Republic. 